what up, buddy? My name is Elperns. Welcome back to yet another React video. Now, I literally just reacted to the She-Hulk uh, official trailer. And literally the same day that video came out, a Russian Badger video came out on the same day. So I'm going to go ahead and react to Russian Badger's newest video, which is called Quirked Up Operator Goaded with the Sways Counter-Strike Global Offensive. When was the last time I heard, heard about Counter-Strike? It's been... Far too long since I've even played. It's been like almost two years since I even touched Counter Strike. Uh, mainly because there was some sort of issue going on with Valve, and all Valve related games were hacked. And people's information were getting stolen at the time. I haven't touched uh, Counter Strike, even though that happened and that issue was resolved. I haven't touched the game since. I don't see myself getting it back into it anytime soon. I might play it once in a while if I get bored. But aside from that, nothing else really. But um, with that being said, guys, we're going to go ahead and react to Russian Badger's newest video. I literally told myself a few days ago, you know, when I looked at uh, Badger's channel, it's like it's been almost two months since his last reaction video. His last video, his newest one is coming out soon. <laughs> Wouldn't behold, it came out this Tuesday. <laughs> but uh, with that being said, guys, I'm going to go ahead and react to this in three, two, one, go. This video was sponsored by Guacamole Gamer Fart 9000. <laughs> Fuck. Let's roll. They're claiming hide and seek, which means they're in the porta potty, which means you open it, I zoo some. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, right. Smitty, prank him, John. Whoa. Prank him. Hey, yeah, I'm gonna no, try. You prank him, John. <laughs> God, my wife is Jesus the greatest. Jesus Christ. Her. <laughs> she got a oh, yes. Right my wife is the greatest. I really love her. The first thing I hear. Cringe. <laughs> Jeez, watch out. Don't step on that clown horn. <laughs> hey, dog. 360. <laughs> God. Why do you own a car 98? Counter Strike Global Offensive in 2022? Fucking cringe. Nah. CSGO has always been. CSGO okay. is hard. Oh, oh my yeah. God. Jeez. It's pretty hard. There's no game that I've ever played that kicks me in the face harder than CSGO. <laughs> <laughs> oh I you saw the top really of someone's up. forehead. It always kind of bothered him. me. Like, of all the games I've played in my 29 years on this earth, why is Counter Strike the only one that I can't crack? Why do I always feel so new? Why do I always feel so green? It's fine. It's fine. It doesn't bother me. It bothers me a lot. It bothers me a lot. And that one's still green. And that one's still green. Don't get the impression that I'm cracking keyboards and throwing mice around my room just because I'm a shitter at CS, because of all the emotions I have towards the game, anger is not one of them. Don't care, didn't ask, cry about it, stay mad, get real L mauled seed cope. <laughs> man, just, man just placed a freaking curse on me. What the fuck? Is the main emotion that I'm feeling. Why are other players so damn good? Why am I so damn bad? And what would it take for me to be a passable Counter-Strike player? All I wanted when I started making this video was one, to not have my head explode 15 seconds in every round. I flash myself. Oh, oh, oh God, they're right there. I got scouted oh really God. hard. And two, to be able to win rounds of competitive while doing dumb shit. Because what's the point of winning if it isn't any fun? No, no. we're yeah. zeusing it. We, you know we're zeusing it. <laughs> no, don't throw me an op, you bitch. God damn it. The fucking brain on you this kid. <laughs> Yes, I do! <laughs> <laughs> to be crystal clear, this is not a guy. I am still fucking trash at CS. I still don't take it seriously, and I will be hard stuck. It's like you to try taking any Valve game very seriously. I mean, Team Fortress 2. What is the first thing everybody does in 2 Fort? Not play the game. <laughs> it's like, seriously, like most games Valve has made in the past, nobody really takes it seriously because everybody just fools around. And the community is just... <laughs> Nothing but it, but laughs. But everybody still loves it. I love it too. In silver, what I do that on two two floors sometimes as well. I just hang out with people and just not play the game if nobody else is. Where I belong forever. I have nothing to teach you, but rather something to tell you. And that's the tale of how I started having fun in Counter Strike. Ah! 
I'm still the shitter that I've always been, but now every time I boot up CS, I feel like a quirked up operator that's goaded with the swouts, and I think that's something to be proud of. Quirked up white boy with a little... <laughs> 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 Quirked up white boy with a little bit of swag busted down sexual style. Is he goaded with the song? And I am so fucking excited hell? to tell you the story of how I got there. Just say swa. Swa. Yeah! <laughs> oh my god, technology. Before we start, I spent over 300 hours of my life making this video, so Are you're gonna shut the fuck up and serious? listen to me talk about my energy drink, Guacamole Gamer Fart 9000. Made oh, by my it. sponsor, Gamer Subs. I actually got yelled at in the comment section for skipping over Raj and Roger. Jesus Christ, that's a mouthful. Russian Badger's uh, sponsorship part. I actually got yelled at in the comment section because I didn't want something that I didn't want something to happen on my video or getting it uh, claimed. But I got somebody yelled at me in the comment section for skipping over that um, sponsorship plug because I know he does it really funny. Well, like, but I didn't want to get something down taken down on my uh, video, so I got yelled at. <laughs> You so now I'm just gonna let it go. Company on the planet, so fucking dumb that they gave me- I think that was on the first Russian Badger video I reacted to, which was the Halo, uh, Halo um, Reach one, the armor lock, armor lock, armor lock one. My own flavor. Bruh. Guacamole like Gamer Fart 9000 is the final form of energy drink. We're talking 100 milligrams of caffeine per teeny tiny scoop. Sorry that I only have bullets for scale. I'm too rich to carry quarters, and all you fuckers know the size of a 9 millimeter, so shut up. Gamer Fart yeah. is incredible. We're talking and no spike in your blood sugar, no debilitating crash, and most of all, no feeling like you're headed for a heart attack. It is sugar-free, tastes like shit. Oh, wait, no, whoa. It's sugar-free, it tastes great, and for the last time, it's not expensive, you assholes. Tuts you out there going, eh, I don't want to spend $36 on a tub when monsters are only $1.50. Shut the fuck up. I drank monsters for almost 10 years. I know how much they cost. Gamer Subs is only $36 for 100 servings, which means 36 cents per scoop. Even if you're double scooping, it's still only 72 cents. So this shit is cheap as dirt. I have two to three scoops every single day for a light boost while I'm working, and I've never felt better. So for the love of God, please buy some. And don't forget, use code BADGER for 10% off. God damn it. Oh. Mode. This story starts with about 7 hours of playtime since 2014, so I wasn't completely clueless about Counter-Strike. I know what an op is, I know what Dust 2 is, I know not to alt tab a source game, 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 and I know that CSGO tops out your microphone when you boot it up. Can you do me a favor and just tell me once my mic tops out? Yeah, I think everything sounds okay to me. The problem is, almost all of those 70 hours were spent in casual 10v10, which feels like you're playing inside of a YouTube poop and has absolutely nothing to do with true competitive fun. 5v5 counter strike. Yeah, no, I hear. you bitch, Badger. Dog, I'm not even good at counter strike. Dude, I'm gonna lick you. I'm gonna lick you, motherfucker. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> was that in game? Hey, that fart sound was really funny. Can you play it again? But like loud with <laughs> So step one was exclusively playing 5v5 competitive to experience true Counter-Strike and start learning how this shit works. And you CS veterans can probably guess how that went. <laughs> Usually, oh, yeah. <laughs> Just oh my expects. god! <laughs> Flashing, backing up. I did 95 and five. Dude. I thought he'd sniped his teammate. Oh, oh my what? god! I think the map might be CT side. Shut up, fucking <laughs> ratio. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, like to say that oh, right? There's no chance. <laughs> right. Oh <laughs> my god, that's hilarious. <laughs> Look at these fucking <laughs> wiggly guys. <laughs> <laughs> Repeatedly getting your head blown off may not sound like fun, but I learned more in those five hours of competitive than I did in 70 hours of casual. And thankfully, my buddies that do play CS like Jello were able to carry my sorry ass. I really don't know how he pulls this shit off with a crosshair that fucking Why disgusting. Why crosshair that big? Yellow, what am I what looking the at? Fuck? A lot of people use it. Man. I don't believe you. That's stupid. That's stupid. It keeps the balance up. See? Pasta, why do you laugh like a fucking hyena? <laughs> Stop. You're only proving my point. Pasta's laughing like Krusty the fucking clown. My name's Dr. Rockstar. No. I'm just cooking. Yo, don't want to fucking. Yeah, yeah. 
On day two, I was fully oh expecting boy. to get my nuts crushed by silvers again, which is why I watched some beginner guides on YouTube, and without fail, they all say the same shit. Lower your sensitivity, stop moving when you shoot. And I was like, what the fuck? That's it? That's, that yeah, can't that's, possibly work. That's literally it, Badger. Struggling. Because your aim improves when you stay still. If you keep moving, your your crosshair just expands. Fuck. Oh, yes. Double headshot. Uh, Double headshot. Hello? Yes. Badger? The collapse. Oh, no. Ace, 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 let's ace. Let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see it. Ooh. Yes, That's the ace. Shit. What the fuck? What? You got an the ace. That's all I had to do this entire time was lower my sense and stop moving? None of you assholes on Twitch could spare 10 seconds out of your dipshit day to tell me that? Now I officially know what it feels like to be Counter-Strike globally offended. Whatever, no, whatever, no. I'm over it. And with this newfound knowledge firmly planted in my lizard brain to stop fucking moving, you wiggly piece of shit. The next step of the plan, master the hard weapons. Because if I can ball out with the most unforgiving guns in the game, all the rest of them will feel easy by comparison. Enter the Desert Eagle. Oh boy. What I would consider to be the most punishing pistol in the game if your technique is sloppy, which made it the perfect tool to fast track my pistol game. All I had to do was stop fucking moving and click on heads. The Desert Eagle chambered in 50 Action Express was gonna take care of the rest. What the fuck map is this? Oh, oh my god. Those I'm not maps. moving. I, I refuse. So I know CSGO got an update recently. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Hang on, play on there. Good shot. That. Stop fucking counting, you idiot. Oh, oh baby. Like, yeah, just You're don't just get scammed, fucking moron. Oh, oh my god. god. Dead. Oh, that was so satisfying. This was a major breakthrough because I was learning the ranges where you can rapid fire and ranges where you have to take it one bullet at a time. Oh. Clicking on heads is great, but learning that you can achieve similar results just by bagged up with the motherfucker at closer ranges was a huge leap forward for me. The way he was hitting those headshots, bro, I know your Xbox 360 bio said snipers get more heads. Yes. Uh, you look like just <laughs> oh, XP I'm just Boom. guessing right Ow. now because I can't Ow. see. Why are they flashing? We just break through. Okay. Jesus Christ. All you have to you know. <laughs> I heard. I was Whoa! Oh, this is Smitty. I heard. I was Whoa! It was in the background. <laughs> yeah, that's. <laughs> God, his ass. Don't oh worry about God. it. He's dead. And finally landing some Sorry, one second. Shot. I want to check something. Yeah, Smitty was in the video. I knew that was his voice right away. <laughs> That's interesting to see Smitty would bang here. I finally had some money for the next part of the plan. The AK. If there is one weapon that has been the oh icon of how much I suck some off at CSGO, it's the AK. I swear to you, it sits in my brain like one of those math questions from high school you know you're never gonna understand. Yeah. You just accept you're too dumb to get how it works and move on. Until now, because I figured if I can succeed with an AK in my hands, it will not only make using every other weapon a picnic, but it will mean that I'm finally not a shitter at CSGO. That is pristine! All I had to do was stand still and fire 762 by 39. Is it it's, really that hard? Yeah, it's not that hard at all. The only call I would use is Holy hold shit, there Calvin. behind you and look out and bruh. <laughs> And br br <laughs> Ooh, that was nutty. Took his head right off. I'm watching, I'm watching under. No! He's right there. Yeah, that's me. I'm going eight. Now I know three is not going to be able to hear your voice. His buddy's going to pick me. Nice. You got that. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it makes sense why Smitty would be here. He used to be a god at playing CSGO back in the day, well, at least when I started reacting to him. I even have his plushies all the way back there. Hey. Those may seem like the most mundane AK shots you've ever seen in your life, but I think they're the tightest shit ever. And just like the Deagle, the plan of tackling the hardest fucking weapon I could get my hands on totally worked. Now that I understood the unforgiving mechanics of moving and shooting with the AK, every other weapon that landed in my hands seemed like a breeze to use.
Literally. <laughs> Nothing made this clearer than running the P90 and MAC-10. Because if you're running and shooting with the AK, you're not hitting shit. If you're running and shooting with an SMG, you're probably gonna bulldoze the enemy team. Not just because you're spitting out bullets, but because you're so fucking hard to hit. I'll just get a big this speed of light. Oh, both of them are in there. Both of them. With your bullets. Yes. With your bullets. <laughs> there you go. Finally, that worked out. ATF Waco. <laughs> Yeah, speed of sound! Utility was my next big breakthrough, and I'm not talking perfect flashbangs, I'm not talking clutch molotovs, I'm not even talking about smoke grenades that these CSGO quarterbacks throw into outer space and somehow land in the exact right spot. Stuff. I'm just talking about keeping each grenade on a separate oh keyboard. Like once I cut out the scroll wheel approach and put frag, flash, smoke, molly, and of course decoy on separate keys, I always pulled out the right one. My nade game is still trash, but at least now I'm throwing a flashbang when I want to throw a flashbang instead of smacking someone in the face with a liquor bottle. Ah, yeah. Shit! Son of a bitch! I forgot it bounces off them. If you if you throw a muzzle top right up at the enemy, I forgot it bounces right off them. It doesn't go off right away. Oh, good lord. Uh-oh. <laughs> Diamond Miner, he's back. <laughs> I can see Smitty's like little thing back here. I probably have to do some editing in this video to zoom in on that, but you can see that only real fans, you know what? I'll be back. I'm grabbing it. I know this is meant to be a badger video, but since Smitty is here, here I have to put it up because Smitty is the only one with a plushie that I actually have here. What? <laughs> what? Smitty's gonna probably see this clip and like, what the hell are you thinking, boy? Good. <laughs> Out. <laughs> oh, Diamond Miner 74 has almost been a year since I've heard that. They don't need. Got to know that. Like, CSGO players, a lot of them hate fun. So Dynamic Crossers are big no no. Got you. Flashbang. That worked. Going. Nice. Double nice. I bought get the kit for a reason, get it, get bitch. It, get it. <laughs> Peter, I can't rush B. I'm handicapped. Uh, oh, oh, run over. My oh. God. <laughs> I got wall bang. What the fuck? <laughs> I knew I was firing on all cylinders when I had the confidence to start using the Zeus. Don't ask me why a weapon that's supposed to be non-lethal is a one-shot insta-kill in CS. I'm just here to laugh at the funny man scream. Oh, I missed. Yes, oh. I was feeling it. That was bullseye. Jeez. Yes, I got him with the I've never Zeus, used the Zeus, actually. Oh, oh, man. I got him right in the fucking it. neck. Oh, he's got a Zeus behind him. Ah, I got him. <laughs> he's got a Power Zeus behind Zeus. you. I have a Zeus behind you. Don't care. Didn't ask. Plus, you're not Zeus. Get him. Yeah, oh baby. Oh, oh, he had his out. Got him, yeah. Oh, my God. He was not looking at me at all. And once I could Deagle, AK, Flash, and Zeus at a non-shitter level, it was time to become goaded with the swouts, which meant one, putting on a static crosshair. Triple six, five, four. Oh, no, what you thought? I'm waiting for this opera to come peek us. He's half. Yes, oh, I God. got him. That's what I wanted. If you want to believe that's what happened on here, feel free. Oh, I'm nuts. I'm fucking nuts. Maybe it's on top of all. Uh, Got him. Got Jesus him. Christ. Because I might even use the op at that nice. point. Seriously. Nice. And two, unboxing a knife. I truly did not care how many cases it was going to take. I was unboxing a knife. I do not care how many it takes. I am opening cases <laughs> uh, until I get a fucking knife. But after unboxing 400 and... Try and get a Shadow Dagger's Crimson Web like Smitty. Try it. 40 danger zone crates, as in 440, Valve shut me down with a 72 hour ban after I spent over a thousand dollars without unboxing a single knife. Bruh, bruh, bruh. Bruh. It was all right though, because the homie Kevbo over on Eesh. Twitch let me borrow his crazy expensive paracord knife that seemed to slice people open just fine. Yes, got him, got him. Yeah, oh, baby, way to go, way to go. And I was so quirked up doing dumb shit with my friends that the 72 hour ban on buying anything flew by like it never had. I'm actually not sure if the three day ban was short or my buddies and I were throwing so many fucking flashbangs every round that I can't remember half of it.
Wait, what was I saying? Give me all the flash grenades flashes, you have. Get it. <laughs> That's bullying. That <laughs> is <laughs> bullying. Wrong. Yep, flash. Oh my god, four flashes! Holy <laughs> 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 That's the entire oh fucking kill feed! That's the entire chat box, we got him, Clue. Pop this, you fucking prick. <laughs> my god! So, so many flashes, bro. <laughs> and we just didn't have enough so flashes many. there. <laughs> Everybody saw it off me, so what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna open up the door, I want every flashbang right through there. All your flashbangs through it. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> Blaine just yeah, laid out two of them. Not a single flash went through the whole of mine. Oh, y'all ain't playing a carnival game in your lives. I ain't never taking y'all to King's Dominion Six Flags. I need you to put one ball in the hole, and you couldn't let y'all the time to put fifty dollars down for that stuffed animal. Huh? Come to think of it, the only thing I do. Yes. <laughs> Do you remember about that 72 hour period was Skulker gaining the ability to speak both forwards and backwards on his soundboard? Technology. So I was. <laughs> you suck that fart back up in your ass. <laughs> don't, don't do don't that again. Do that. <laughs> don't do that Please. again. Why are you like this? Why is, why is it reversed? <laughs> <laughs> God damn. God damn. God damn. It was quite clear that those of you on Christ Twitch Skullcrow. were tired of hearing his mic spam as soon as you heard it for the first time. If I see another swouse, I will fucking fire my car at 98k into oncoming traffic. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Why do you own a car 98? But like I said, the 72 hour ban went by so quickly that there was no need to fire a car 98k into oncoming traffic. After three whole days of waiting, it was finally time to roll the dice again. I was not feeling optimistic about my chances at a knife because to jog your memory, I opened 440 crates over the span of three straight hours on Sunday and did not get a knife. That shit is fucking trash, dog. Get the fuck. So it's safe to say that when I started the case opening stream on Wednesday, I thought I was going to be up all night. No way. <laughs> Wait a second. You got case hard and shadow Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> got him, this but was like five well. minutes of opening. How the fuck do I go for 440 and not get one. And then this is, that was 19. God, those look awful. <laughs> <laughs> I know, it's great. Lightly shitted daggers. I don't even know if you can call those lightly. Those are just shitted. <laughs> <laughs> and in typical CSGO fashion, even the lightly shitted shadow daggers had a learning curve. Oh, damn. Really? I've oh, never right? had them, so I don't know. Oh, you gotta switch for stats. Damn it! Fuck, man. I knew that stabbing did more damage than slicing, but I had no idea that stabbing had a shorter range. And what the fuck is this Swiss Swiss stab ultra combo anyway? It's fine. It's fine. I learned my lesson the very next round and was poking everybody with my lightly shitted shadow daggers all night after that. Oh, look, if you go up to a wall, you right click it, you don't hit it. If you left click it, you do. Okay. I am digging. Yes, I got him with it just oh, when yeah. you say that. Oh my god, he gave me his off too. Just when you're schooling me on Switch Switch Snap. <laughs> I just stuck it into his neck. That flash. Oh. Ooh. Oh, Fine. you're peeking along with an op on ramp. Get him, Switch for Snap. Yes, yeah, got him with the yeah, butt plugs. You. That's all I wanted. Oh my gosh. I'm all. <laughs> oh. Oh, <laughs> Oh, right out of blood. Yes, poked him oh, with so the butt plug. Yeah, yeah, baby. Five more games. <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> Son of a bitch. Did you just <laughs> All right, you just hit bing like that. <laughs> there goes Evan Wayne. I was so you excited I had to do it. I will admit, I was fully cognizant and aware of what I was doing. This was not an accident. With my organically sourced shadow daggers figured out, it was time to expand my CSGO repertoire by using the only weapon more difficult than the Deagle, the R8 revolver. My buddies all really love the difficult? precision of the left click, but I don't play that shit. If there's a loose end that needs to be tied up, I'm fanning that bitch until it takes someone's head off Arizona Ranger style. <laughs> oh, what was that? Ooh, like that, like that, that was fucking like that. nutty. I'm just gonna fan around this corner. 
<laughs> oh, <laughs> bummer. Bummer. I'm going back. I bought this for a reason, fucker. Yes! Yes! It worked, baby! Cash money! Oh my Whoa. god! My oh fan my worked! Yes! I know at this point, plenty of you are pulling your hair out because it's this late in a CSGO video and I still haven't mentioned the op, but I have a confession to make. I don't really like the op. I'm not saying yeah. I'm too good for it, and I'm definitely not saying it's ineffective because it's crazy powerful, it's even in the hands powerful. of a shitter like me. I can, I can oh god. You're literally the most powerful sniper rifle in the game. Oh. There you go. It just feels like a goofy-ass point-click adventure game. Like, am I playing Pajama Sam or CSGO? And why would I fuck around with an op every Pajama round when Sam. I just blew 300 bucks on a factory new Stat Track M4 Hyper Beast off a guy from Ohio named Skylar Hates Alice that clearly likes anime? <laughs> because at this point, I was undoubtedly busting it down sexual style, but I couldn't be goaded with the swaps until I had a Hyper Beast. E-Cash wasn't too happy about me spending that kind of money on a factory new skin while I just opened a brand new knife. But who cares what he thinks? I'm the one holding the hyper beast. Like you motherfuckers. What? I just bought it outright. I got money. Killed one. Got one. My first kill with the hyper beast. He's goaded with the sauce or without. With the sauce? Now, Tucker, it's sauce. terrible to say the white boy's not good with the sauce. I've seen him firstly. Who wants to hold the hyper beast next? <laughs> <laughs> I do, I do. Why are you doing that to my rifle? My rifle. Mom said it's my turn on the hyper beast. <laughs> I, <don't know. laughs> I found this on the guy that I shot at Badger's hyper beast who wants. <laughs> <laughs> Why is oh, everyone carrying my hyper beast? The only thing more satisfying <laughs> than finally owning a hyper beast was finally figuring out which maps are god tier and which maps should be outright deleted. In my opinion, the single most important factor as to whether or not I'd have fun in a game was the map we picked, because I don't care how sunshine and rainbows positive you are, if you play some shit like Vertigo, you're gonna get smashed by people that only play Vertigo. These dudes is uh, not here to play games. They're here to win. Honey, we're all here for Thanksgiving dinner. Why don't you tell the family about your favorite smoke spots on Vertigo? <laughs> <laughs> but if you pick some shit like Nuke, you're guaranteed to have a blast no matter who the other team is. Shout out Franz J for turning Nuke into a complete Complete fucking circus, by the way. I remember it as a nightmare map back in the day, and now it's a non stop clown parade where every round is filled with such horse shit that it's always fun. Who's behind me? Oh my god, I'm sorry. God, I love pickup. Pickup is fucking right. tight. Oh my god, I whipped it. Yes, was, it worked! That yeah. pickup! Does your cat stole uh, your radiator? How does a cat steal a radiator? Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> what? Goofy as hell. What the hell? <laughs> no, bro, he do be certified in H. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you going to heaven, big boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What? 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 Play your soundboard. Do the soundboard. <laughs> Come then. Oh, oh my god. What? Did he get an ace? What? <laughs> <laughs> you fucking thought! What timeline are you? What am I doing? Oh my god, I cannot breathe. I cannot breathe. The only map that comes close is Office, which feels more like a Gmod prop hunt map than a Counter Strike map, but we play it more like Gmod anyway, so I guess that checks out. Imagine. <laughs> oh, Holy shit. What? what? Paul Die. Walker. <laughs> I feel like I'm ding dong ditching. <laughs> oh my oh. god! Okay, two of us are up here. God help if they swing this corner. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh, oh, I'm nuts! We have to go. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Oh, oh there we go. Got him. The last one was in the. Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh. I don't think this other team just know what hit them. Mom! 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 He hit a clip! He hit a camera! <laughs> Oh, what just the fell fuck over? Oh, <laughs> this is a scary up. peak. Oh my mm. god. Just don't move. Do not move your feet. Because then we're going to TK. Okay. I am <laughs> fucking dead! <laughs> Didn't have a chance to react. <laughs> <laughs> that second guy got oh. laid out. Imagine turning the corner of three AKs and an op standing in a fucking cheerleader pyramid right next to you. Oh, collab, baby! Excuse me. 
Oh, I almost took your head off. Wait, we're doing- Oh, I got him. Even if office isn't your thing, Mirage is good, Cash is good, Inferno is good. I don't play Inferno because all of my dipshit friends care more about chicken kills than regular kills. But my point remains, there's plenty of good maps out there. All right, most chickens killed. Let me see it. Yes! The Colonel, bitch! <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What? That's an actual <laughs> thing. I told you. You're gonna hate me for saying Dust 2 is great, but it's great. When I finally managed to clutch you out on a team that was clearly better than us on Dust 2 with an AK in my hands, it truly felt like I was no longer a shitter at CSGO. You can call me a dipshit silver, you can nitpick any detail of this video you want, but this round finally made me feel like I was playing Counter-Strike and finally made me feel goaded with the swaps. Fine. Got him. I, oh my God. <laughs> Calvin was in front of my shot. Mickey flashed the whole team. Cause I thought you were going to die. I saw you pushing over to mid, so you check it. I was gonna push the car. Boy. Three. Nice. That's three. I should have just slowed him down. That's four. Oh, right. One v one. Yes. Nice. 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 Fucked up. My God. Clutch. How does he do it? And that's the story of how I became goaded with the swaps in CS:GO. If there's one lesson that I've learned, it's that you need to play Counter Strike to enjoy Counter Strike. Let's roll. Like fuck, I spent well over 600 hours making this video, three quarters of which was just shit posting in the Source engine, and I'm still not tired of Counter-Strike, so do yourself a favor and play CSGO. Oh, Yo, why do you have an Amogus on your back, Calvin? Wait, why? Uh, I do? What the hell? Oh, you just a mask. Slap your ass. <laughs> Plus, <laughs> stop your ass. How dare you say that to me, Gross, and I'm a Reddit gold user. Oh, what the fuck? You just, <laughs> <laughs> just woke me out of my nap, bro. That, me that to activated my fight or flight response. Turn that and bullshit wanna, channel uh, off, bro. I'm trying to go back to bed. I'm understanding this correctly. Your name is Tardo the Ass Monkey? <laughs> yes, that would be I. Booger, why is the very hungry a... caterpillar dead after oh, a combination boy. of malnutrition and blunt force trauma? <laughs> 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 Blunt force trauma to the head is what yeah. killed the very hungry caterpillar. Yeah. And that's about it, dog. It's oh, time shit. for me to CS go. Shout out to you guys for patiently waiting this long for this goddamn video. I'm pretty sure I spent so much time in SFM that 25% of my brain is now rendered in source. If you could do me a huge favor and buy some fucking gamer fart and use code badger, it would mean so oh, much shit. to me. Because just taking two months off to make a video like this, <clears throat> it is not good for my money situation so if you could just buy some fucking gamer fart it would just be so much better for yeah the way that i make videos is just not good because of all the demonetization and age restrictions so if you could do that for me just buy some gamer subs i would really appreciate it thank you a final thank you for watching and again waiting this long for the video and be sure to tune in next time when i soundproof this motherfucking room <laughs> That took me for a win. I was not expecting that from the from this video. I didn't expect Smitty of all people to show up. I don't think I've ever seen Smitty hang out with Russian Badger. So that kind of took me for a loop. I actually gotta see check out Russian Badger's merch store. So whenever I react to his videos, I should just get merch. So Smitty, yeah, now. <laughs> Um, but with that being said, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's react video, like and subscribe, all that stuff, guys. And I will see you in whatever the heck I record next, because I literally have no idea whenever I make these videos. It's literally going to be either something from Russian Badger, oversimplified, which I'm waiting for a new video on, um, something else entirely, or it's going to be Pixel uh, Kane Pixels with uh, the backgrounds, which she has been teasing about multiple new videos about. So I will check that out when that comes out, probably tomorrow if that's the case literally when i record these videos literally a new video of one i want to watch comes out the next day but anyway we'll see what happens like subscribe all stuff guys and i'll see you in the next reaction video bye